So I'm Dr. Gavin McStay, I'm an Associate Professor of Molecular Biology and I'm the course leader for the Masters in Molecular Biology. So the degree is a full-time and part-time course which focuses on molecular biology and different aspects of molecular biology related to fundamentals of the topic and also information about different diseases and different aspects of how the, the topic is developing. Most students are working in the science industry. Some are looking to advance their career by obtaining a master's in molecular biology so that they can progress to the next level within their own company or move on to a, um, another position at another company requiring a master's level. They'll be learning fundamental practical techniques for molecular biology, such as um, PCR, gene cloning, library analysis um, and uh, cell culture, aspects of immunology related and mi microbiology related to molecular biology also. So you'll be picking up practical skills but also um, how this applies to different areas related to molecular biology. As part of the degree there is a, um, a project module which is where you conduct your own kind of independent research. Depending on where you're based you can carry you can do this at your workplace, so this project could be um, very related to your current work role and the, uh, the research you're doing there. Um, if you're not in a um, research-based environment or a lab-based environment, you can come to the Stafford University Laboratories and do the project here under the guidance of one of the department members who have a range of interests from in molecular biology, from genetics, cancer biology, immunology and microbiology. So this degree should enable anyone to go into further research-based careers. So this could mean either going on to a PhD or directly into an academic lab as a, um, as a researcher. Uh, or you could go into pharmaceutical uh, companies, biotechnology companies at a master's level entry um, researcher also. But then there are also, um, also the ability to move into teaching, science communication and um, science policy from this area because of the wide applications of molecular biology in today's society.